Welcome to the account solution. It's all of our Excel templates. And in this video tutorial, I will just show you a simple way to count your inventory with the use of a barcode scanner. If you own a supermarket or a shop or a warehouse where the products have barcodes, instead of counting your stock one by one on the shelf, you can use a barcode scanner and your computer and count the stock as it's split on your shelf from shelf to shelf. It doesn't matter if you have different stock in one shelf, you can use this simple template, the barcode scanner, and you will perform your stock count exercise. When you download this template from our site online, this page will pop up for you. Always enable content, also enable for addicting. Do not delete any cell full or column on this application. By ensure that you um, understand this video before you use this template. And this template can only accommodate 200 product names. Once you're okay with this page, you go to next. Now, what you need to do is to export your stock inventory balance from the software you use to manage your sales and inventory. Put them on an Excel sheet in this format. Have your product barcode, product name, product group, and the book balance that you exported from your software or your Excel file. When you have that, just copy them and paste from under these headers. So just grab the one I've set up, just a, just a simple uh, stock list to demonstrate how this template works. Just paste here. Now if you look very well, you see that I have my product book balance for my system. Then I have fiscal count is zero. Then we have the variance and the max showing 30 for all the products I have here. Now what you need to do is to go and count your stock from shelf to shelf. So I have this product as lined here on the shelf. I'll just count them with the battery scanner. I will come back here to see the report of this. So I'll get to my shelf. I'll come here on this stock count sheet. So we'll click on this first row and begin to scan. So on my first shelf, I have an ITEL phone, a couple of them here. I shelf, I have a couple of ITEL mobile phones here. I just scan them one by one. That's one. Just going from product to product to count how many I have. Okay, I'm done with the phone shelf. I'm moving over to the speakers. I have just one speaker product name on the shelf.
Okay, I'm done with gadgets. So let us go to our stock account report and see what we have. Now you can see uh, from the first phone, we had 10 in our system and we counted 8 shortage of 2. For the next phone, we have 5 in our system, we counted 5, so it's balanced. Um, Techno 3660, we had 4, we counted 5, we have access. And up to the speakers, we had 15, we counted 16, we have 1 access. Now let's go over to the other shelves and see what I um, have um, on them. Put your stock count and continue counting. I have a Bodman screw here. Another one. I have a blue band bottle here. Quite a number of them. Also have cherished bread. I have an ever water table water here but quite plenty What do we have next? Avalanche water. We have it at the first field panther. And it's white. We have a sun light this washing liquid. Also have one last bright here. And we also have some more sunlight.
there's one more bug wants to here doesn't matter where your stock is kept as long as they are kept on a shelf in the store or the market you can use a barcode scanner and count them doesn't matter how they are arranged if you have different products on one shelf you can still count them with a barcode scanner the template helps you sort them they are different foods and assemble the count for you let's go to our stock count okay there we go we have all our products counted you can see the liquid sunlight had 17 as a product book balance but we now have 18 fiscal count with excess of one you can type in the reasons for this variance and print out a report for management of a uh, owner of the supermarket or for your personal use thank you so much for seeing this video tutorials i hope it will be useful to you and if we will count um, your stock effectively and very fast you don't have to waste time going around the shop and counting one after the other the pen and the paper with this template you can do that just with your back scanner and your job is done if this video has been useful to you and you know this template will be useful to your business you can like us on youtube subscribe to our site and be the first to get our articles as we release them also be the first to get our video tutorials on our subsequent templates thank you very much and god bless i believe this video tutorial has been useful to you to get hold of the template you can go to our website at www.theaccountsolutions.com and then look for the free templates page and download the excel file you can subscribe to our youtube channel to our website and be the first to get our videos and our articles on our templates thank you cheers